Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to VWE EXP. This is your captain speaking, Memo Falcon here alongside me. Is. I am Kyrie, the boy diva over Achiba Paramore. Boom. That's right. But ladies and gentlemen, we are here at EXP and we are looking forward as we are literally one day away from Overdrive. But nonetheless, yes, sir. But nonetheless, I believe we're just you know gonna go right into it. So, uh, if uh, I think I'll you know introduce the first opponent. Okay. All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, from Vanderbilt University, and she weighs in 110 pounds, at a height of five foot nothing. She is Becky. Hey Becky, how you doing? All right, we'll watch your pom poms. Oh, at least I got pom poms. But uh, yay hey, pom poms! But it's gonna be interesting to see how she's going to fare against her opponent, so you could introduce her. Alright, and her opponent from Transylvania, Romania. She weighs in at 210 and stands in at 6'3". This is the Trans Transylvanian Tyrant Carmilla Alucard. And I'm not gonna lie, nonetheless, she is, she's pretty much what I like to call a vampire behemoth. I mean, just look at the size of her. Oh wow, you weren't kidding. It's hard for me to kid about something that huge. Well, I mean, I've seen, um... I've seen some big chicks before, but, uh... None as the same regular size as Carmilla there. Oh, not all, but, uh... I'm going to tell you right now, if you haven't seen her action, you're about to see something that's uh, very rare among women. And that's just a straight up powerhouse detail. Oh lord, poor Becky. Poor, 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 poor Becky. Well, nonetheless, I'm going to cheer for Becky because that's what we do. And it looks like Becky wants to cheer instead of wrestling. Aww. Uh, <laughs> and Carmilla turned her down. No. And I'm hungry. Yo. Oh, the bell's been rung, so uh, there we go. As the match is underway, as here comes Becky Ed. Oh my god. She's. <laughs> oh, and Carmilla just pushed her down. Apparently, Becky believed that she was a powerhouse, but uh, I don't think uh, that's it. <laughs> no. 
So as she's getting back up, and she looks like she's going right to the road, say, here she comes, right after Kabul, and... Ay, yo, smeal! Ay, yo, smeal. Ow. I <laughs> think she... I don't know, but... Whoa, whoa, wait a second. They can start a fight back now. I mean, I felt that later, but don't... there she goes, right in. Oh, God. Ooh. And right flower back One, so probably. Two. Only a two count. Oh my god, yep. Yeah, uh, come on, yeah, she is hungry. She's hungry for wins. And I mean, I kind of feel sorry for her, Becky. But there was Becky, she hits the ropes right now, she goes right to the corner, and oh god, here goes Kamala, and oh! Oh, oh lord. Oh god, as though she goes, and I might! Ow! That is... 210 pounds of twisted steel there. That's 210 pounds of straight up, uh, vampire. Hey... I, I, I mean, I would, would I, uh, <laughs> I'm just baffled right now. One, two, only Hello. two. But right now, it, as clearly Carmilla has the, uh, well, both the size and weight advantage. I'm not sure about speed, though. Oh, you don't, you never know with these vampires. That's true, oh boy, wait a second, here goes Carmilla with those punches right now. That's why that she tosses Becky right back into the corner. <laughs> as we see the fans, as they're saying bite the leg, but here comes Carmilla and rushing for a splash, but no! I shake Cor, but what way say here comes Becky with a schoolboy! One, One two. two! No! Oh, Becky must have mustered up some good strength there to roll up Carmilla. Oh yes, that's right now. Wait a second. There was Becky, she goes right to the top rope right now, and Carmilla does not see her anywhere. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. She... Oh she oh she's seeing her, or maybe she's a little bit dizzy right oh, now. Oh she's yeah, she looks oh. a little bit dizzy right now. Wait a second, here comes Becky! Oh, um, Becky's so, going for it again. Yeah, she went for a splash, but oh, oh, Jesus! Oh, that does not look good. Oh, that does. Right now, Kamala's gonna go for a pin. One, two, and no. My goodness! My goodness! Oh my goodness, as this is definitely a, a very interesting match right now, I mean, I think the, I think the, well, James just wanted to tire Becky out of something. As right now, it looks like, it, it does like a game of cat mouse, and right now, Becky is definitely like a mice. But right now, it looks like Kamo is just right behind Becky, as always, as she has Becky as, oh my god! As she as Carmilla just hit Becky with that dragon suplex. And if I was Becky, I wouldn't be moving. I just you know just take it and leave it. So I know there goes Carmilla. She hits the ropes. Oh boy! As oh. she goes and fight. Oh my God! Ah. That's two hundred ten pounds of big splash. Very big splash. One. Two and no! As Brace says, whoa, there goes Becky, she gets right out of the frame quickly. I think she went for a timeout. I mean, I don't blame her, I mean, that's her opponent right there. Oh my god, but Carmella's just going right after her. Mm hmm. Oh, I know, oh god, it looks like Brace Camilla has Becky right by her neck right now. As she just tossed her right back into the ring. Now 
It's right now it looks like that uh, Becky is in the. Uh, she's in a bad spot right now. I find out that Kabula is just stalker. her. I find out it's. Oh, and Becky just stumped her. Is that even a good idea? I think. I guess so. She hits her with a drop kick. And it comes Becky. Then she goes with those kicks. Right to the leg and right to the midsection. So that's Becky's good hand. Good thing. So wait, oh, so then she goes in for, for again. The kick now. That's it. That's right, there goes Becky. Becky. Just, oh. oh ha, ha, ha. What was that? A Bronco Buster? I don't. Yes, know. it was. <laughs> also known as face full of stuff. <laughs> right now, Becky has a. Uh, Camille's leg as well. She just places it on the rope. Oh, oh, God! What's Becky thinking, dude? Uh oh. What is it? It looks like Becky's getting uh, pumped up. Like there she goes right to oh, Boom. And, oh, wait a second. As Camilla rolled out of the way. Yes, she did. Yes, she done did. And now Becky's paying for it. This is this is very bad for Becky right now. That's why that Carmella's pick her up now. Oh god, know, she says she's doing very. Her. I'm very impressed with Becky so far. She's holding on her own and and stuff. Oh, wait a second, but there's Carmella. She goes twice the ropes, and then she goes to the Hadouken! <laughs> oh, damn it. I was expecting a, a, a wisp to come out of her hands. Well, she goes right to the pin now. One, two, three. That's oh right. my god. It's good night. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your winner, Carmilla Arlucard. As right now, as uh. Let me see. I don't think we need ambulance or something like that. I mean, Becky is still somewhat alive. Maybe. Alright, now I'm down to myself. As, no, Becky, that's not your coach! Yeah, I mean, Camilla with a uh, very impressive win, but uh, as right now, it's, oh, God, Tanith. Yeah, I think uh, Becky heard that and was like, no! That's why that was, Becky's okay. She's fine. That, she's not fine. Oh, wait, wait, she's fine. Hey, Becky, you forgot your pom poms! Becky! Oh, too late. Alright, but uh, no less, uh, we're going to go right to a short ad break. So I'm going to start off. Alright, go ahead. Alright, so ladies and gentlemen, we have to think a couple of our sponsors such as Sinful Desires. <clears throat> and Team Wildfire! The sh shout heard across from the grid team wildfire is the jack of all trades in second life when it comes to marketing and producing from t-shirts logos videos animations posters and more anything that will let your friends and fans know it's time to burn you can access the wildfire vendor at the vendor section all at a reasonable price and let me just get this here make sure to Catch our videos right here and our product listing, tinyurl.com slash product. The lineups fill up so quickly, so get in line. Contact Larry Phoenix or Rainbow Falcon. Team Wildfire, burning two years strong. Yes, I have a tiny URL. Do you want to learn more about your favorite wrestler in Second Life? Well, look no further, ladies and gentlemen, because TimusDeNovo.blogspot.com has your information of all your favorite SL wrestlers. 
update weekly with new interviews. If interested, contact Tyrus and Nova Cerevi in World. And we are not responsible for whoever hits Tyrus, just to let you know. Because <laughs> you die. Yes. And we are also brought to you by Get Like Me, Big Baby Animations. By Terry Colt. Bye. Giving you brand new animations and custom moves in the world of professional wrestling in Second Life. For more information, contact Derek Colt in World. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming to the VWE tonight as we are put on for your entertainment. Please feel free to donate any possible lindens behind the commentary table in the collection box right behind in the main arena. And yet, all donations are certainly appreciated. And... If you've been looking for a way to promote yourself or your place of business outside of normal means of simple ad boards or wasting your money on classifieds, hmm. If you want your product or services to be seen and heard in front of a live audience such as this one, or on demand, well, ladies and gentlemen, look no further because Virtual Wrestling Entertainment is now offering new sponsorship packages. Sponsoring the VWE is a great way to promote your product and services as you promote new throughout our arena on our website during our three weekly live shows and our show replays. Please feel free to contact Crystal Neutron or Austin Knight for more information on advertising. So ladies and gentlemen, uh, you can go ahead if you want, Falcon. <laughs> Well, I mean, we do have this note, but however, ladies and gentlemen, as we know that Overdrive is tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen. Also, uh, if you guys don't see video, just look up, look above the uh, ring. But, ladies and gentlemen, what also, a unique have a way to show it off. <laughs> I know, right? Best production for you, but I also have this a note here that says, Due to major dieting, Razor is now 190 pounds. He took the j -Rod weight loss program and only ate Subway sandwiches for the last couple weeks. Subway sandwiches. That's the key! But uh, I believe we're going to be doing this main event style, so, uh, rock, paper, scissors? No, you okay. go ahead, Falcon. <laughs> you okay, go ahead. I'll, I'll go ahead then.
All right then, ladies and gentlemen, are you guys ready for the main event as I take a sip of this Pepsi? All right then, so introducing first, to my right, as he stands at 230 pounds, a height of 6 foot 5 from Baltimore, Maryland, Ren. Blackheart! And now to my left, ladies and gentlemen, as he hails from New Orleans, Louisiana, a height of 6 foot 4 and weighing in at 190 pounds, the indestructible Razor Dark War! As well as, ladies and gentlemen, as your referee for tonight is Tenet Karisuma, the Foxy Ref. So, so, hey, good luck, and it's gonna be an awesome match, so let's get right to it. Well, there we go, the match is underway, Kyrie. Alright. That's right, so it looks like that weight loss program definitely did good with Razor. Well, he was fat before, it doesn't... <laughs> I don't get it. No, he wasn't fat, I mean, he was just... He was buffed, but it looks like, you know, he just slimmed down because he wanted to be faster. But there goes Ren Black, oh, he's just... Oh, that's good. Yep. There goes Ren Black, he's just wrenching that wrist of Razor right now. Ooh, there goes... there oh, there he God. is, and a Crescent City kick Ooh. from Razor. That was cool. <laughs> that was cool. As there goes, oh, there goes Razor. Oh. Here's his Hurricane Alley sending Ren down to the mat. Oh, yeah. And there goes, as he goes and hits Razor Burn. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Oh my god. Now it's gonna go and pin it's... on Ren. One, two, and no. No, close but no scar. Let me tell you now, as watch that speed, Razor definitely went pretty damn. He got faster. <laughs> oh, I said, but there goes Ren, and he hits the ropes, and go right and back and more he's... inverted DDT. Also known as a Stalin DDT. Stalin? Alright, but right now it looks like Ren's gonna go for a pin now. One, two, no. And no. As right now it looks like that Ren Blackheart is definitely looking strong, but Razor's. As Razor, he is, de he definitely got quicker. Oh, yes, he did. Well, there goes Ren that as oh as he is that big suplex as he sends Razor back down to the mat. Oh boy. <laughs> That's right, but it looks like Ren is not done yet. So there he goes for a kick and oh Ooh. Oh, as Ren said, that was something learned in the dungeon. Believe me, the Derek Colt's dungeon. dungeon. Oh boy. One, two, and no. As Razor, he is not even close to being done yet. As both men have fared off, you know, before. But right now, it's a, it might be a little different ball game for both Ren and Razor. So now Ren is picking him up and oh, as he is that kick and right into a short haircut. Womp womp. <laughs> I don't even know what to call that kick. 
could call it what, what Stewie's kick, uh, Ren's kick. No, I meant Razor's kick. It looked like a uh, couple of kick for a minute. Or well, you could call it the indestructible uh, knockout or whatever. I don't know. I'm feeling very uncreative today. <laughs> But nonetheless, as right now as Razor picks up Ren, and there he goes. Uh, oh, ow! and he goes with a drop kick and to the face as well. Oh my god! My goodness! My goodness! So right now, Ren immediately gains control right back after Razor's uh her Kavana. But wait a second. Right, so it looks like Ren's go to the top. He's always oh, he's gonna hit that front flip as he hits it and he connects. Oh, he connects all right. And now he's going for the pin once again. One, two, nope. And no. He does not get it. It was only a two count, and Ren is Ren is thinking like how. What can I do? <laughs> no, you're gonna have to do more than that, Ren. But right now, it looks like that the uh, Razor's game right back up, but it looks like Ren is just stalking right now. Oh, yeah, he sure is. And here comes Ren. But oh. racing is racing, guesses, and ow! Oh, I do a jawbreaker! Ouch. Oh, that's gonna be leaving a mark. That's right, but right now it looks like that Razor is not even done yet. It's finally he picks up Ren Blackheart as he tosses him right to the corner now. Yeah, he just she just shoves him all the way over there. And there he goes oh, and he's oh! going for that Mardi Gras hangover. Wait, seriously he calls it that? <laughs> oh yeah, definitely. And right now he's gonna go right into that front face lock now. And locking it in tightly it seems. And he's literally just pulling Ren out of the corner. As looks like he's trying to set up uh Ren for something now. As there goes and oh my god, another Crescent City kick! Oh my goodness. Oh my god, right now Ren is, Ren is down, he does not know where he is right now. Well, wait a second. This race is going to go to the top and he goes right to a... Oh, he goes, go, he goes into Gator Roll, but no! Wait, so there's Ren, he hits the ropes, and goes for a flying splash! Oh. That's right, he's gonna go for a pin now. One, but, two, and no. Nope. That's right, now literally, at Razor and Red, I definitely, you know, being very impressive right now. Right now, it looks like Ren is pick up Razor now. It's right now, he tosses him right to the ropes. Uh oh. Right now, Razor is high and dry. It's right now. Oh! Drop kick over the ropes! Uh oh, and he's just outside right now. That's right. And once you're outside, only a couple of things can happen right now. As, uh oh. Wait a second. I don't like that look in uh, Ren's eyes right now. Uh oh. Oh boy. That's what he says. Right now, Razor's getting up, but wait a second. Here comes Ren Blackheart. He's going right through the ropes, and he is a suicide dive. Oh. oh. Oh my god. Alright, guys. That was definitely a nice one. Right now, as both Razor and Ren are out, outside right now.
So now both Ren and Razor are getting up right now. Right now, Razor does not even know where Ren is, but wait a here comes Ren Blackheart. As well, wait a second, as that was Razor, he is the Razor Blade Hurricanrana! Out of nowhere! Impressive. So right now, as the ref is at five now, and pretty much Ray's just stomping there, red there, red. That's right oh, now. He's going like for great... another front face lock. Yeah. Uh -oh. oh, looks like he's dragging him to the barriers. Yeah, he's trying there. to toss him back inside the ring. Ah. Uh... So now they're both getting right back into the ring now, it seems. Razor, Razor, but right now Razor is right out at the uh, apron now. And Razor, right now is Ren is getting right back up and. As Ren does not see Razor now. So he's just trying to push up by the corner, he hits it, and... Ooh. Oh! Springboard front muscle missile drop kick. As he sent Again, you know what? Muscle drop kick does sound even better, so it could be either way. <laughs> right now, that was a nice drop kick. As right now, as... Wait, 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 wait a second! Pre-roll up! One! One! Two! Two! And no. Oh, he kicked out in time. Oh, that could have been very close. Sure, true that, true that. Right now, has uh oh. Oh, it looks like Ren is starting to, you know, <laughs> starting to get fired up now. And so, there he goes. <laughs> he's a punch. Oh, he's going for those chops. That's right now, he tosses Ren right to the corner. Oh, but it's right now, it's Ren is thinking about what to do right now at the corner. And here comes Ren Black Eyes. He hits a big ol' high knee oh. right to the head. That's right. There he goes again and. Oh, Ooh. into a shining wizard. Wizard, shining wizard. Mm -mm -mm. That's, that's right now, it's. So right now, it looks like that uh, Razor Ren is waiting for Razor right now as... Oh, he's, he's, wait, really he's waiting to strike his prey. That's what he's doing. Yep, and here comes Ren and... Ow! He oh, he a kick! Yeah, that's not gonna end well. <laughs> he's gonna go for, that the going for the pin. One, two, three! And there you have it, folks. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner of this match is... Ren Blackheart. But definitely, both men put one hell of a fight. However, you know, with the you know with the weight loss program and you know Ren race again like ten times faster. Ren Blackheart still you know is the victor in this matchup. As that was definitely a good match for this edition of EXP. As you can see, as both men definitely shake hands.
But ladies and gentlemen, this has been a good Yeah, really good form of sportsmanship there. That's right, but ladies and gentlemen, as definitely that was a good match. However, this is the end of EXP as we are going forward for tomorrow. As tomorrow, it will be Overdrive, ladies and gentlemen. Overdrive. That's right, however, tonight we have to end the show. So, this is me, your captain, speaking, Rainbow Falcon here. And this is Kyrie Paramore. Thanks for coming, guys. See you tomorrow for Overdrive. Oh, yeah. This video was filmed on location by Zarakan Productions. Zarakan Productions is an umbrella group for many YouTube shows and businesses both inside and outside of Second Life. Please go to zarakan.com for a complete listing of shows and businesses associated with Zarakan Productions and their own media links. Zarakan Productions shows have been organized alphabetically in playlists in a year, month, Day format for easier video navigation. Multiple part videos have been named accordingly starting with part 1, and the last video of a multiple part video series will have end as a part of its title. Please like, comment, and share this video as it helps both Zarakan Productions, and the creators of this video's content. Also, be sure to check the playlists for past episodes of show content, and subscribe to this channel for future videos. Thank you for watching, and happy wandering.